Okay, just got the, uh, the motor gun being mocked up. So I got it mounted on some brackets just temporarily right now. What we'll do is probably give it some welds here or nuts and bolts. I haven't decided yet um, if I'm going to weld it or, or weld it and, or nuts and bolts to hold these brackets on uh, here in these four points. Um, got the chain on. Let's see, bring the light down here. So we got the chain and the sprocket. That's ready to go. And it looks, uh, looks good. Nice tension on the chain. Uh, nice and balanced here. Nice and straight. Lines up perfect with the sprocket. A little close here, but it's, you know, of course, once it's bolted, it's no big deal. As it stays bolted, I guess, right? So, it's, uh, about a half inch clearance. About a half inch clearance in there. I think we're we're okay. Uh, that's it. So tomorrow I will uh, wire up the motor, run the wires up through here, through the here. It's raining, so I have all my electronics covered up. So, run the wires up through this crack here, and spot here for the uh, motor controller. But that's it for today. I'm going to wrap the motor up with a plastic bag, and uh, that's it. So as soon as the controller done, that's what we'll be waiting on tomorrow is just the motor controller. After tomorrow, I should say. Um, I'm going to have that mounted, the DMD motor mounted. Um, all the wires ran except for the few wires here for uh, that'll hook up to the uh, Alltrax controller. All right, thanks a lot.